by Peter Hirschberg. Thank you very much for joining us on the show. It's great to be here. A lot going on. The term smart city is still a relatively recent one. How well does Dubai lend itself to the, that kind of urban innovation? Well, you know, it's, it's kind of a geeky term, and it's only about four years old. And I think, and it's not a very consumer-friendly term. It's like smart city is a great term if you run a city or you're a vendor selling stuff. So it's interesting to unpack what a smart, what a smart city is. You know, and it, it came about because all of a sudden we have huge amounts of communication, sensing, networking. So at its core, suddenly we could make cities more responsive, more efficient. You are a serial entrepreneur and uh, you just came from Apple. As cities become digital platforms themselves, yeah. what role sh should government play here? I mean, it's been also a talking point at this event. Traditionally, a city is something government ran, right? You know, you had the, uh, the, there were the administrators and the departments, and then we were consumers and we used it, or maybe there's a real estate developer. But as cities become digital, they almost behave like platforms, the way that Windows or iOS is a platform, right? So when you build a platform, what do you want? Well, you want a great developer community. You want lots of people building apps that find you, what's going on in the city. And when that happens, you suddenly open things up. So you have the government working on it, you have corporations, and amazingly, you have lots of individual people who, who are working on it. With that in mind, I mean, what potential is there in public-private partnerships? Yeah. And how you know, would it apply to Dubai? I mean, yeah. are they doing a good job in harnessing that potential? So I think Dubai has you know, a strong government that can get done what it wants quickly when it wants to. It has a great advantage because this is an era that actually favors trying things and getting stuff done. And I think Dubai has the opportunity to kind of look at all these smart services. And this seems to be as hotbed an experimentation as any place. If you were one of the people helping draft this future vision of a smart city, what would it look like? What are some key characteristics? Uh, kind of in the olden days, the future was something that the government and a corporation handed down to you, right? So today, clearly the future is something that's co-created by thousands of entrepreneurs and lots of universities and all sorts of innovation. Um, and there's so much innovation going on these days. When you think about the Internet of Things and smart materials and wearables and new forms of transportation, that you need to turn your city into a laboratory where lots of people can experiment and open up. We'll leave it there. Peter Hirschberg, thank you very much for joining Thanks. us on Access Release. Thank That's you. Great.